Hi, this is Maria and I'm in front of Sweet Memories Nostalgic Candy and Toys in Redlands in Southern California. This is in downtown Redlands in the historic district. So let's go in and check it out, okay? Here we go. Oh my gosh, this is really cool. It's a really small store, but it's really cute and quaint. And looks like there's some toys over here. Oh look, there's some kazoos. Oh, remember that? The Fisher-Price telephone, the xylophone. Hey, look, some sea monkeys. Anybody remember those? Look. Oh, look at this. It's a little miniature Bopham <laughs> Bozo. I grew up watching Bozo. This is great, and they're only $5.99. Oh, those are really neat. There's your little sock monkey. These are really cute. <laughs> I really like these. And I remember these flicks. They're $1.55. That's not bad for today's prices, but when I was a kid, the going price for a candy bar was a nickel. These might have been a dime. Big cherry. If you've never had a big cherry, you have to have one of these. These are great. Fizzies. I love fizzies. These are $3.99. I used to get them for 19 cents at, um, at the Five and Dime store. Hi. Hi. I'm making a video for YouTube. Are you guys from the area? Uh, yeah, we're in Loma Linda. Oh, okay. And hi, how are you? Isn't this a fun place? Say hi. What's your name? Whitney. Whitney. Hi, Whitney. Is this your brother? Yeah. Hi. So are you out here just for the day enjoying the sunshine and... And have you ever been in this store before? No, it's the first time. Really? And so what do you think about it? It's good. Lots of, lots of candy. Uh-huh. Tell me, what did you find? I see you have a little brown bag. Let's see what he bought, you guys. Okay. Only because I'm nosy. Uh, I got some Warhead spray. Oh, okay. Did you used to get that as a kid or something? No, actually I got it because I've never had it before. Oh, okay. What was your favorite candy as a kid? Caramel. How about yours? Um, I don't oh, really remember. Oh, I like all the sour stuff. And Whitney, do you have a favorite candy? <laughs> Not really. She liked what she gets. She got the um, candy cane. Oh, you got a candy cane? Is that what she got? Yeah. <laughs> okay. She picked it out. Oh, did you, is that what you got? You got a candy stick. That looks yummy. Yum. Are you going to share that, Whitney? <laughs> <laughs> okay, thanks you guys. Have a great day. Bye. Hi, my name's Maria. Steven. Hi, Steven. Is this your store? Yes, it is. This is really cool. So how long have you been here? We've been here a little over a year now. A year and three weeks, actually. Okay. We have like uh, 72 different kinds of sodas. Wow. Uh, all glass bottles. Um, most of them ha are made with uh, pure cane sugar. Uh, we have... Um, uh, our uh, little Mexican section. Oh, okay. Wow, Day of the Dead. That seems kind of unusual to have in a candy store. So why do you have Day of the Dead items in here? Well, it was actually the other owner's idea. Um, he, he lived in uh, Santa Fe for okay. years, and he fell uh -huh. in love with the Day of the Dead. Okay. Yes, but uh, he brought all this in, and people love it. Um, we have a Frida Kahlo. Um, so colorful. What made you decide to open a candy store? I'm from Florida. Okay. Um, I've been here almost two years. Um, and I was here on a market night and I was walking up and down and I saw this little candy store and it was uh, for sale. So I got my friend and we threw it together and we bought the candy store. And I noticed you have a lot of nostalgic things here, like oh, even yeah. these signs are really nostalgic. And so with you being so young, why are you interested in nostalgia that you weren't even born yet? It's, it's our past. Everyone likes our past. Huh? I have the, the old toys I used to play, That's the Fisher-Price telephone and the xylophone and the, uh, the old, from even the old candies. I, I don't remember most of them. Um, the flicks and we have so many different stories. You, there's a store that everyone has a story for each candy they find. Oh, so your customers come in and they all have stories to yes, tell, and their memories? Some of them are funny and some of them are crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but we're the nostalgic sodas. Are these them up uh, here? Yeah, uh, we have some. Some okay. are nostalgic, some are novelty. Okay. Um, see, like uh, skis and old soda. 
Oh, okay. Uh, we have Frosties. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, bubble I remember up. Bubble Up. <laughs> Do you remember Bubble Up, you guys? That's great. And another one. They changed the label on it a little bit, but RC. Oh, Cola. yes, I remember RC. And RC Moon Cola Pies. Moon Pie. RC Cola and Moon Pies. If yeah. You RC, they usually get a Moon Pie. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's great. That's great. Do you get stories where people remember taking their soda pop bottles back to the store to get a oh, yeah. uh, deposit money back? Yeah, and um, finding the bottles or returning mm -hmm. the bottles. That, and they would find the bottles or return the bottles, get the money, and then go buy candy. Right, that's what we used to do all because, in the neighborhood. <laughs> like back then, not like today, candy was really cheap and you can buy several pieces of this candy. Yes, we did. I mean, with a dollar you could go to the store, the corner store, get like 20 cents worth of candy, 50 cents for the movie, and you'd have money left over for a taco and a Coke yep. on the way home. All for a buck. Yep. So, so this is um, a store that brings back a lot of childhood memories, a lot of good memories. Mm -hmm. And it's a feel-good type of yep. store when people leave. What's your most popular item? I think it is the Abba Zabba. You, Why the Abba Zabba? Let me show you. It's, okay. Uh, it's We're going to go look at the Abba Zabba. The Abba Zabba. Uh, this it has a very distinctive packaging. Um, most people remember it. Okay. We have so many people, they love it. Um, it's a candy they knew and remember. And it was a really popular candy back then. Oh, I love your uh, Coca-Cola crates up here, the old Coca-Cola crates. Yes, some of those were donated uh, by some great customers that we have. Oh look, there's an old-fashioned TV. Oh my gosh, that could have been right in my living room. <laughs> Looks like something we had. And there are some cigarette candies. I know some people may not want their kids to have those, but um, my sisters and I, we had our little cigarette candies and none of us are smokers. They were just fun, <laughs> and they tasted like um, wintergreen. Let's look at the box. It's like this retro box. That is so cool. Oh, look at that cute little, that's really clever. The little um, business card holder. What a clever idea. I love this old candy box right here. And look at these really cool signs, these superhero signs. Fantastic Four, Iron Man, Hulk, Wolverine. Captain America, Superman, and Batman. Batman. I mean, how cool is this? Who wouldn't love this, right? And look at this really cool refrigerator. Okay, does anyone remember this refrigerator? This is probably back from maybe the 60s, I'm thinking, 50s or 60s. We used to have one of these uh, refrigerators in our garage and the milkman would leave our bottles of milk in there in the early 60s and it would get really ice cold. Anyways, this is really, really cool. Well, these guys have done a really great job with this store. And if you ever get a chance, come on down. It's down in downtown Redlands, historic downtown Redlands, uh, right off of State Street. And I'll go ahead, uh, look below in the description box and I'll make sure I put all the information there for you if you wanna come on down. Do you, uh, can people also order online from you? Is that available? Um, Do you have a website? We don't have a website, we only have a Facebook, but if you know of a candy or a soda that you want that we don't have, I can look for you. Most of it I can find. Um, a few of them they don't make anymore um, or they don't distribute anymore. Okay, so actually your customers can, um, they can call you or come down and ask you, they can order a specific candy and you'll look for it for them? Yes, ma'am. That's really nice. What a nice service. That's great. Okay, so no website yet, but you have a Facebook page and it's called Sweet Memories? Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right. Okay, everybody. Well, thanks, Stephen. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.